hey kids, want to build your own race cars? Well, our next guest is a casual multiplayer online game producer and virtual world targeted specifically to boys and their affinity with cars, racing, and fun. Of course, girls can participate too, but let's face it, you know, sometimes guys want to just build their own car and make it all happen. The co-founder and CEO of Web Cars is Chris Bergstresser. Did I say that right? You did indeed. How are you, sir? Oh, just swell. Glad to have you with us. Uh, of course, the virtual world and the casual game markets are flooded typically with websites for sure. kids. So what made you decide, first of all, to target boys specifically with what you guys are doing? Well, if you, uh, well, stepping back, I mean, it's, it's, one of the few entertainment markets that's really rapidly growing right now, I think there are about 5.3 million kids uh, playing in online in some way, shape, or form, mostly on virtual worlds. Uh, it's projected to be about 20 million by about 2011. Uh, so that's a pretty substantial growth curve, uh, specifically for boys. I mean, if you, if you look at how virtual worlds and a lot of the gaming sites have uh, positioned themselves, um, uh, their social mechanism almost always kind of skews female. Boys, as we know, socialize different than girls. You watch a playground, you see boys uh, jumping around on the uh, uh, slides and things like that, and you know they jump off the slide and say, hey, look at how I did my compound fracture. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that great? <laughs> and and so, uh, so it's, it's really sort of measurable achievements for them and uh, a sense of competition, and although uh, Club Penguin and Webkins have fantastic services. The games they have on there uh, don't have those social components that really appeal to boys. And uh, we feel that as the market does expand, uh, uh, boys and girls will be looking for uh, experience that are really relevant to their tastes. So we see there, there being a very specific opportunity to uh, service that marketplace. Well, then what kind of gameplay would we find with web cars? Well, uh, again, uh, looking at what boys play, uh, you know, we see that most of them, although some are playing online, a lot of them are still playing console, and it's because they like that fast-paced, kinetic video game experience. And uh, we wanted to bring that. So it's a big virtual world split into a lot of different cities. Uh, the kids get to make their own vehicle and although it's called web cars uh, uh, it's really creating your own vehicle and kids have made everything from x-wing fighters to uh, something that resembles a 62 Lincoln Continental oh, and, <laughs> and everything else maybe, in between. Maybe influence from dad. Yeah. yeah. And uh, so anyway they um, they go into the virtual world they can crash into buildings race around drive up the sides of buildings teleport here and there and uh, gain points, uh, win badges, and uh, socialize that way. And I'm assuming parents can feel comfortable that if they're involved with web cars, it's not only a safe environment, but they might even learn we're, something. We're utilizing CRISP, which is the best chat filtering system out there. We have a huge group of people to really monitor that. Good. And we're using Flash 10, which is uh, uh, incredibly safe. Terrific. Web Cars, C A R Z Z. Correct. Webcars.com. We'll link you to Chris's site. You'll see what his folks are up to. You got to check it out. It's very cool. Still in beta, right? When will it be available? It, it will be closed beta in April, open beta in May, and uh, you're welcome to come and get a beta key right now if you want. There you go at webcars.com. Back with more <laughs> from San Francisco after this.